What's going on guys? Victor Brand here. Guys, welcome to Wild Wild Africa channel. This is a channel that we're going to be talking about Africa. I'm actually filmmaker behind the series Waterman of Savo. I used to work for the Kenya Wildlife Service. So I have this passion about animals. I have passion about Africa. So I'm going to show you the Africa that I know, not actually the Hollywood style Africa. I'm going to show you the Africa that I know. So what are we doing in the middle of nowhere? Because actually we are in the middle of nowhere. We can see I'm actually in the wild right now. This is a few meters from my home where I live. I come from a very small town that is called Foy. It borders the Safo East National Park. Today, guys, we are going to be tracking. I learned how to track uh, animals when I was working for the Kenya Wildlife Service. So I'm going to show you the animals that come out at night. I'm not going to show you the animals. I'm going to show you the footsteps and we're going to track where they come out from. So that's why we're in the middle of nowhere. I find those footprints. I'm going to be trying and find like the footprints from this morning. Because this morning, lions came up. I've actually seen the footprint. So we are going to find where they come out from. Where is that gap? Because we have an electric fence surrounding the national park, but we have to find where they come out from. So come with me, guys. Come. And here, guys, we find the tracks from the lion. You see, it's just quite a small lion. It's still growing. So let's just follow them. Guys, you can see a few minutes. Guys, I think I found a, a good one actually. One that I will say it might be able to explain every single thing. So let me just turn around the camera so fast so that I can show you. So guys, as I found out, it's not just one hippopotamus. I found another set. So I'm going to be showing you the, the other set. But actually, it's not one hippopotamus that we are looking for. They are, I don't know, right now I, I got two. So I'm going to be showing you quickly and then we move on because we need to find those lines. So, guys, this is the path that they follow. So let me just walk here. So, guys, I'm walking and the reason that I'm whispering is because I have to be very careful because Africa is wildest animal.
this part is because I don't know where the hippos are. Here we have the tracks from the hippopotamus. And on this other side, we have the tracks from the lions. You can see these are the lions tracks. Lions tracks. So the line is quite small. I, 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 I will say this is barely like big enough. This is like, guys, this is the hotel. fresh lion tracks these are fresh lion tracks over here this is where they drink water from. you can see and this is the beginning of the dry season so we are going to expect more of this I suppose I'm going to be seeing more of this so this is where we need the farms Guys, three days ago, this river was full of water. You can see the whole river. The whole river is just dry, like that. This river was full of water. I'm going to show you something that made me track these hippopotamus this fast. So hippopotamus has a habit of spreading its feces across. So I'm going to show you a clip right now how I found them. So and this is from this morning. So let me just show you. So you guys do see how this feces is just spread up to this tree. And this is actually fresh. Let me just pick one. And this is actually fresh. This is from this morning. You can see it's quite green. This is from this morning. Though the sun has just made it so dry. But this is how I track them. This is how I found them. There is actually this meat from Africa. They say that uh, <laughs> the feces from the hippopotamus is actually good for the cows. If you mix it with water, I don't know if this is true, but this is just a uh, at meat, they say if you mix this with uh, water and you give the water to your cows, actually your cows will just grow big like hippopotamus. This is true, I just don't know. I just have to tell you what I know about Africa. This is the reason why we started this channel. Uh, to tell you African stories in the African way. There is certain African communities that believe that uh, land I know it's not true, but I don't know what you guys think, just hit me up in the comments, we'll discuss this because I don't know if it's true, because some African communities believe that this is true, but I don't believe it, because this is just West, this is West, animal West, but I, I don't know, you guys can debate this on the comment section, but this is a simple African myth over this fence over here it's uh, the national park so southern east national park it's quite true let's turn the camera this way so that you can so we have come to the end of our video guys so hit that subscribe button hit that like button because there's more coming from this wild wild africa channel so this is just the beginning i promise a lot is going to come i'm going to do a lot on this channel so we've come to the end of this video.